Hello, I'm Seth Gosworn, and today I'm going to be talking about should adolescents be allowed to drink alcohol. Alright, here's the agenda for today. We're going to start off with our potpourri, then we're going to do a warm up, then we'll get to my presentation, and then you guys are going to applaud my great presentation. Alright, for the warm up, the uh, question is the more of it you have, the less of it you see. What is it? Money. Darkness. Darkness. <laughs> Are you Brad? All right. My topic is: Should adolescents be allowed to drink alcohol? Uh, in the book, it talks about how different activities during adolescence can affect the brain and its development, and we're going to look into that a bit more in the presentation. Um, the research that I found supports that drinking during adolescence can have a negative effect on the child's brain as it's developing. Uh, brains and bodies of teenagers are still developing and alcohol can hinder and cause learning problems uh, if it's drink whenever they're still developing. Research shows that the human brain doesn't stop growing until the age of 21 or 22 and before that alcohol consumption can alter or retard that growth including memory and test taking abilities. So that's why the government has 21 set as the legal drinking age because they didn't just make that age up, they actually had a reason for it and that's because that's whenever the brain is said to be done developing and it's not as dangerous to your brain then. Um, the first source of evidence was from lab rats actually. They were given very large doses of alcohol. Uh, large enough quantities of alcohol appeared to cause brain impairment in young rats, especially if they're given uh, them over a long enough period of time. So that's just talking about like, it wasn't just like a one time thing, but they kept giving them the alcohol on that. And it did show actually that it caused uh, some retardation and some problems with the brain development. Um, my refutes, my research, I didn't find any sources really that just came out and said that alcohol wasn't harmful in some way, whether that be in a physical manner or if it be like your decision making and how it alters how you think whenever you're uh, intoxicated in that. Uh, some of the sources did however say that uh, they think that alcohol um, didn't have such negative effects as the brain damage, but they couldn't deny that it did make them do stupid things and make poor decisions. Uh, also, some people argue that drinking in adult supervision should be allowed because then the adults can teach the kids how to drink in moderation uh, and how to drink responsibly. Uh, this is a great idea in theory. I mean, if you can teach the kids how to you know, drink responsibly in that, that way you don't have to worry about them going to get in the trunk whenever they aren't supposed to in that. But, I mean, it's just that. It's in theory. I mean, I don't think that some parents out there today would be responsible enough to control their kids' alcohol like intake in that. So, I mean, in theory it's a good idea, but I don't know if they could follow through with that. Uh, Drinking before the age of 21, which is the legal drinking age, may not affect some as much as others. A lot of it depends on your body type. Like if you're a bigger guy, then it's not going to affect you to drink a few beers as much as if you're a petite woman. So, I mean, a lot of it's that. And it's how much you drink, how often you drink, and what you're drinking really. So, the effects, they could be really bad or they could be nothing at all, depending on all those variables. Uh, this is a video. Recreational drugs were tools. Alcohol would be a sledgehammer. I mean, it is here. All of the statistics and information we have say, you know, that, that it is here and that kids are struggling across the board. And it's not because, you know, of anything we did or didn't do, it's because they're kids, you know, and this isn't a perfect world. This is happening whether you like it or not in this community. We can't ignore the fact that there's a problem here. It's been documented, and rather than being frightened of that problem, I think it takes a community to really pull together and come up with solutions. 
was a lovely kid with a, a great future that made a terrible decision one night that cost him his life. You know, I definitely do know people who um, they had too much to drink and who ended up in situations that I know they um, regretted. I'd say when I went into high school, it became more of a lifestyle. Everyone thinks they're going to be okay and that nothing bad is going to happen, and it does. Um, you know, not all the time and not most of the time, but it does, and when it does, it's big. So I drank, you know, all the time. That's who my friends were, you know, the partiers, you know, and it was it was fun, man. It really was. I want parents. All right, they can stop it. All right, the main reason why I wanted to show you guys that little clip was because it was just talking about how in high school, like, they didn't come out and say it, but basically they were feeling peer pressured into drinking because they had they thought to be cool, they had to drink. So, and then they also mentioned how they go on if they kept playing it and talk about how their friend died because of drinking and driving. But um, it's just one of those things, like they said, it's not something that like it happens all the time or even most of the time, but whenever it does happen, it's a really tragic thing and it still is, still is very sad. Um, personally, I'm very strongly against adolescent drinking. I believe that the legal age uh, to drink is 21 for a reason, like I mentioned. The government didn't just pick that number, they have a reason behind it. Um, and, I mean, if you want to go ahead and risk, like, not being responsible for your actions and that, you can, but that's just something I'm not willing to do right now. So, I was just wondering where you guys stand on it now. Anybody have any input on how they feel about it? Angel? Yeah, I, I think I agree with you. Just as far as like brain development and stuff, yeah, I feel like it should stay at 21 as far as drinking. Yep. I agree. All right. All right, there are my references. And that's the end of my slideshow. And I just want to point out this beautiful poster I made. And that's all. Thank you.